I've seen the entire body. What are you covering for? It was so dark that night. You probably didn't see anything. Oh, is it so? James, what are you doing? Kelly, didn't anybody tell you that you look nice in this dress? James, you drunk? Why are you so sweet today? How do you know I'm sweet? Without even kissing me. James, you drunk? Would you stop being a spoiled sport? I'm very happy today. What's wrong with me gets a little drunk? Why are you so happy about? It? The woman I spent my first night with gave me three kids. That's why I'm happy. I'm happy that you're sweet. Yes, honey. You made me want to kiss you more. James, you said it was your first night. That's right. This is not only my first night. But also the only time in my life. The only time. So you're so horny. But you're right. It's the only time I've ever done it. Damn you! You should take responsible for me. But I didn't realize you had three more children with other men. James, what do you want from me? What do I want from you? I'm going to erase all traces of other men from your body. Make you mine. James, I don't have another man. You're my only man. James, I lied to you. The six children are all yours. They are all your children. Forget it. He's been fulfilled to me for so many years. I should stop teasing him. I should tell him the truth. Besides, I'm not afraid of him stealing my child since I have pigs by near. James. Bester. Bester. Miss Sullivan. Sorry, Miss Sullivan. Sorry, Miss Marna. Sorry for disturbing you guys. Go on. Mrs. Sullivan, Mr. Sullivan and Miss Moana are inside. They're inconvenient to see you. Nonsense. We are family. What no inconvenient about meeting us? I got it. Uncle, are mommy and dad looking and kissing? We are going to have a sister soon. Oh, I see. It's my fault. My fault. Mr. Ziegler, you stay here. Don't let anybody. I'm going to have my seventh grandchild. <laughs> Miss Moana, why are you so quick? How should I answer your question? Is it Miss Sullivan? That's right. Is what you think it is? I'll leave first. How did you get triplets in the first place? Kelly, this is the Sullivan's banquet. What are you doing here? You didn't attend when Bailey invited you. Yet you're shamelessly coming now. Such a shameless speech, Nico. You should just stay home if you can't keep your mouth shut. You are the God's orders. How dare you? Got hair. Kelly, Nico is just worried that you can't get in without an invitation. That's right. How about you get in? If you keep this up, I will take you into embarrassing ourselves. You hear that, Kelly? Bailey took you in out of kindness. Otherwise, with your appearance, you surely won't be able to go into the servants. Kelly, you're all dressed up. You must really want to go in, right? Why don't you kneel down? And apologize to baby, Kelly. 
Do you know how to knit a doll? I'll teach you if you don't. How dare you hit Nico? Her boyfriend is a director. You're done. Tell the woman, you'll see. I'll have my boyfriend come over and get you fed right away. Hey, hubby. Come quickly. I'm being bullied. By me? Fine. I will wait and see. Still being stubborn. Let me tell you, today is my big day. If you keep in, I'll make sure you don't get fed. Who the hell are you? Do you need to leave me? The animal then. How dare you talk to Bailey like that? Do you know who she is? She's here to pick the penny. You are just an intern. Well, Bailey, is the heir of Pig's Pannier. Why don't you near dog and apologize? What do you mean? The heir to Pig's Pannier is Bailey Reynolds? Yeah, let me tell you, Kelly. I don't necessarily need to use this identity to pressure you either. Just give him and apologize to me. Bailey, what's the point of her? She's not on the same level with you. She does not even deserve to lick your boots. The era of Pig's Pioneer. That's interesting. James, I'm busy. I'll talk to you later. What? James called her just now? Does she know him? Tell him when. How beautiful Mr. Sullivan by Names are meant to be called. Why can't I do so? Did Mr. Sullivan really call you just now? Did you make that up? Mr. Sullivan belongs to Bailey. This party is specially organized by Mr. Sullivan for her. He called you. <laughs> I think you're afraid of us. That's why your staying is on purpose. I mean it. Why would Mr. Sullivan ignore such a promising ear like Bailey and focus on you instead? Kelly, let me put it this way. I know, James. He's considerate and good. He's the dream man of a lot of girls out there. I'm here today to make a stand. He's mine. In the past and also in the future. If you dare to steal my man, you'll be cause mistress. Are you out of your mind? Who is that? Who are you to scold the head of Pixel Pioneer? Liam, that's her. Kelly, how dare you annoy Miss Reynolds? Don't be angry, Miss Reynolds. I'll call Miss Louise Gardner right away. This ungrateful woman should be punished. Well, you get Miss Gardner over right now. Let's see what he'll do to me. Kelly, who do you think you are when Miss Gardner has to come here himself? Kelly, are you scared? Kelly, if you're scared. Get down on your knees and lick Miss Reynolds' shoes clean. I'm not afraid to let Miss Gardner know all the good things you've done. Liam, are you deaf? Who told you I'm scared? We're so afraid of me calling Miss Gardner. Fine, you call now. We'll wait and see. Well, wait and see. Mr. Grant, can you put me on the phone later? I didn't realize it would be so easy to hook up with Louis. I read a book before returning from abroad. It was about how to seduce old men. Yes, it really can be handy. The huge big spaniel is one step closer. All right, Miss Reynolds. Tell you. Thank you. You're in for it. Hello, Mr. Gardner. Sorry to bother you so late. So I wanted to tell you about、uh, my college, Kelly. What? Do you want to talk to her? You are such an honorable man. Hold on. No, Uncle Louis. Said her. Said, Kelly. Do you really know Miss Gardner in prison? I don't know, but he'll probably be here soon. Miss Reynolds, that's great. Miss Gardner really thinks highly of you. He's even willing to put his neck out for you. After all, Bailey is Mr. Sullivan's main squeeze, and Miss Gardner wouldn't dare over Mr. Sullivan. Kelly, you must be feeling jealous. With the way Bailey is being treated, right? You said Mr. Sullivan caught you. Now you're going to see that Miss Gardner not here to stand up for Bailey, but for you. How if I say yes? Kelly, 
Mr. Gardeners do that for you? So hilarious! Callie, I think there's something you might not have figured out. I joined Pix Pioneer as a new designer. But I want to make steady progress keeping on my feet on the ground. I'll tell you what my father and Mr. Grander are old friends. He promised me the airship himself. Kelly, you're just the lonely delivery person. Well, Bailey is from a famous family. And it's Mrs. Sotman's lover. Mr. Gardener is very focused on training their talents. So you should know your place. Don't bet of more than you can chew. Okay? Mr. Gardner. Uncle Louis. Mr. Gardner, you're finally here. If you aren't, Kelly the Badge is about to pull some dirty tricks on Miss Reynolds. Yes, sir. How dare she disrespect the picture here of Pig's Pioneer? She must be banned from the whole industry. Kelly, I hope you haven't sold yourself scooter. Because you're about to go back to delivery. Uncle Louis. Kelly repeatedly contradicted me on her first day of work. Does Miss Reynolds mean I should fight Kelly? Oh no! I'm just hoping that Kelly will do less to jeopardize the company's interests. As long as we're united, we can create more value for the company. Don't you think so, Uncle? Louis cares the most about the Big Spineer's development. My words must have struck a nurse with him. There's no one better than me to be the heir. Kelly, what do you think? Uncle Louis, Mr. Reynolds, if they're not good for a company united, why don't we disband the design department? What? Kelly, what are you talking about? Kelly, there are thousands of employees in the design department of the Pix Pioneer. Who are you to disband them? Mr. Gardner, you closer to my father. Why would you listen to Kelly's opinion? Kelly, you bitch. You better not be hitting on Louis before I do. Otherwise, I won't let you go. Miss Reynolds, who's your father? A friend of mine? Miss Garner, don't you know Miss Reynolds? I'm the CEO of Pixel Pioneer. Why would I know a new employee? This... Miss Garner, that is also a newcomer. What's your relationship with her? Do you want to know? Then listen up. Kelly's the next CEO of Pixel Pioneer. She's my chosen heir. This... What? Why are you too close? What's your relationship? She said the heir hasn't been closer yet. Why is she the heir? Has she already stopped with you? Kelly! You're so shameless. Mr. Gardner would be a father. I can't believe you slept with him. It's got him. You asshole. Miss Reynolds, you are disgusting as you're revealing pictures your father sent me to my office. Kelly, let's go. I'll go in with you. Miss Moana, what's wrong? It was my fault for not recognizing you. I was deaf. So it's you that Miss Gardner told me to take care of. Miss Oliver's secretary even asked me to help you cut down on heavy work clothes. So it's all you. Get lost. Liam, what do you mean by that? Are you saying that person Mrs. Sutton secretly asked you to take care of Miss Kelly? That's impossible. James knew that I'm joining Pix Pioneer today. Why did he ask someone who take care of Carl Movena instead of me? Uh, bitch! Are you trying to get me into trouble? I remembered clearly the name the secretary mentioned was dot with constant hate. By the moment you came in, you said that you are Miss Sullivan's old acquaintance. Liv, stop being your first. Bailey Reynolds, there's a lot of big shots attending today's banquet. I will give you a chance to redeem yourself. Bring us in and introduce us to them. Bailey. I heard that Mr. Sullivan's granny is going to make a special announcement at the banquet. I'm amusing that she must have known that you were returned. So she's trying to get you and Mr. Sullivan together. In that case, it doesn't matter whether you're Pig's Pioneer's heir. You'll be the only woman in the world who's up to Mr. Sullivan's game. That's right. 
Mr. Grant, Nico is right. Although I'm not the heir to Pig's Manor, my status is ten of thousands times higher than yours. You, if you guys want to go in today, follow me. Closely. Hello. Please show me your invitation. Invitation? You peasants! Open your eyes. Look, this is my first time hearing such statement. You are even need an invitation to go into Sutman's house. I'm sorry, ma'am, but it's the rules. Everyone needs an invitation. Everyone needs an invitation. Yes. Then why didn't you ask for Kelly Movena's invitation when she went in just now? Miss Kelly is a member of the Sullivans. She doesn't need an invitation to enter her house. It's not the same case for your outsiders. Since when did Kelly Movena become a part of the Sullivans? What kind of families she considered us? How honorable is Kelly's status, Bailey Reynolds? You lying bitch! This time you've made me offend Miss Moana completely. I'll kill you. Stop it, Auntie. Auntie, you're here. <laughs> <laughs>